Bob, an enthusiastic DIY gold hunter, had read online that electronic socket pins contained tiny amounts of gold. So one weekend he declared asterisk, I'm going to be rich, asterisk, and raided his old computer parts like a pirate searching for treasure. Armed with pliers, a magnifying glass, and a determination stronger than industrial adhesive, Bob carefully removed hundreds of tiny socket pins from motherboards, CPUs, and RAM sticks. Hours passed, and he had a small pile of golden-looking pins. Asterisk jackpot. Asterisk he whispered to himself. Next came the acid bath process. Following a questionable YouTube tutorial, Bob mixed nitric acid and hydrochloric acid in a plastic bucket. Science class had never warned him about the asterisk. Run for your life. Asterisk stage of chemistry. The mixture started bubbling aggressively. Smoke rose. Bob's eyebrows curled. His wife ran in, took one sniff, and immediately threatened to exile him to the garage forever. After a few terrifying minutes, the reaction settled. Bob filtered the liquid, added a mysterious white powder, which he was 70% sure was correct, and lo and behold, a tiny speck of gold appeared at the bottom of the jar. He picked it up triumphantly, squinting. Asterisk, that's it? After 10 hours and a near-death experience. Asterisk. Bob weighed it. 0.03 grams, roughly worth 2 cents. Defeated, Bob sighed. His wife, watching from the doorway, smirked, asterisk, at least now I don't have to worry about you quitting your job. Moral of the story, some gold isn't worth recovering, especially if it costs you your eyebrows. See you in the next clip.